Buenos dias. In this video I'll be describing the difference between the Harmony Ocarina and the Polyphonic Ocarina. Now the Harmony Ocarina is more like the normal instrument that you're used to, having a full 8 note major scale on each side and one side is pitched lower than the other one. And they play in perfect harmony together, and like the much like the piano and several other instruments that you know of. So these are very practical. Um, however, not maybe the best for a beginner unless you have a passion for it. Then it doesn't really matter. I started playing this uh, as a beginner, and it, and I just picked it right up, and. So it, it is a little more difficult to play. It takes a little longer to learn songs because you can do so much with it. All the flat notes and just all that whole scale. So definitely more practical. And the original idea for these was actually the double medieval recorder. Which can do the same thing. Except the low side is one note short of that. So uh, now the fully phonic ocarina is not quite like that. This one is easier to play because one side is just a drone. And on this one, there are four different notes on the drone side. Each side is pitched exactly the same. So take this, this side. So I usually just use these two, but so it's it's very fun to play with and very easy. Um, there are some others out there that I'm not real familiar with too many others, but there's this one here which is actually only one note on the drone side, so it's all just played on the other side. Then this other one has like six notes on both sides but so the again the difference is that these are the same pitch on both sides but they play really good together like playing two flutes at the same time like the there's a there are like the double penny whistle there's this other one that's wood uh, there's the double native american flute but the only way to play the full scale on each side the double medieval recorder or the harmony ocarina which is cheaper and much easier to, to find so um, if you want to look for all these kinds of instruments uh, you can look all over online for them it can be a little daunting to do that I will soon have a web page where I will make it quite easy for you to find everything. I'm going to put it all right on my web page, pictures and descriptions and where you find all these different ones that I can find because these are very interesting, unique instruments. So I've done a lot of searching and know where to find pretty much most of these. So a lot of them are international and so they're very uh, fun instruments. So. Um, so I hope this video just helped you to decide which one you might want. Uh, let me know in the comments which one you like better or uh, which one you would like to play. Because the, these are um, definitely very fun to play. The Harmony Ocarinos, that's got to be my most common one played. It's just the most practical However, for the songs, you have to write your own clef because they do not actually write songs for the Elkrina. And if you try to convert uh, the, the clef on the piano music into for this instrument, it will not work. It will not sound quite right. So I write my own clefs, and I will be selling my own books for this instrument eventually. Uh, so if you want to check that out, they will be on my webpage. And so please give this video a like or a, a comment and 
you'll help me out and help boost the video so others can can see this information. A lot of people may not know about uh, either of these, I guess. So, but they're really interesting and unique instruments. So, hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.